A BT reset is when you reset a BT system so that it pulls it out of a secure network and into the default home. You should do reset when you either lost access or you were never given access to a secure network. This means that you're locked out and you can't control the BT fixtures. Doing a reset will send them back into the default home, which is the Alliance network. And from there, you'll have access to the fixtures and then you can put them back into a secured home and make sure you share with anyone else that might need access to those fixtures. You could avoid doing a reset if you're able to recreate the secure network. You need to know exactly how it was named. So uppercase, lowercase, and spelling needs to be exactly the way it was created. If you're not able to do this, then you want to do a reset. You'll want to do the reset when you can see the lights turning off and on and blinking. These are all visual cues that will let you know that the reset has been done successfully. If you're using the IT Transformer to do the reset, you can do this by using the app. First, you have to connect to the IT Transformer and use the dashboard to toggle the lights off and on. When you do toggle, there is a slight delay as the transformer is performing that function. So when you're doing the reset, you want to make sure that there's power to the lights, but you start in the off position. And then the reset goes on, off, on, off, on, off. off on, then the lights will blink and change to white, and this is when you know the reset has been done successfully. If you're using the IT Transformer and you're not able to perform the reset properly through the app because of the delay or for whatever reason, you can also do it by touching the wire off and on on the voltage tab. Now this is a low voltage system, so I'm not at risk of shocking myself, but if you remove the 14 volt side, like so, and you take the wire out, you can turn the lights off and on by touching the contact, like this. So to use this method to do the reset, again, you want there to be power, but you want the lights to start in the off position. And then the reset goes on off, on, off, on, off, on. The lights will blink and turn to white and this is when you know the reset has been done successfully.